Hey you guys, so I have some scripture that I want to read to you guys real quick and then I'm going to get into this video. Mark 16, mm, chapter 16, 16 through 18. Okay, whoever believes and is baptized will be saved, but whoever does not believe will be condemned, and these signs will accompany those who believe. In my name they will cast out demons, they will speak in new tongues, they will pick up serpents with their hands, and if they drink any deadly poison, it will not hurt them. They will lay on their hands... They will lay on hands of the sick and they will recover. So I've been seeing this everywhere, you guys. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit is like, speak about this. Us as Christians, we should not be struggling with lust, perversion, all of these different spirits. There is a thing called demonic oppression. And yes, you can have that as a Christian. You have to pray and fast and ask God to reveal to you what spirit may be attached to you what may be oppressing you um just like depression all these things like we when we are set free we are really free we have the power and the authority to cast these things out you can go to your church and go to the altar and get these things um cast it out of you you can lay in the presence of god and ask him to take these things from you god has given us the authority to trample on scorpions and serpents heads we as Christians should not be struggling with lust, depression, anxiety, all of these things. These are spirits that they have came, they've come into you when you were out there sinning. So, you know, when you sin, you open a doorway to allow these things to happen. So, you know, once you get saved, you have to, ugh, you have to figure out, you gotta pay, I'm just upset about this thing. Once you get saved, you got to figure out what it is that you're dealing with. You know, because guess what? Those spirits are not you. I struggled with a lot for a long time thinking that it was me. Spirits were with me for so long. I was, I just thought that it was a part of my character, but I'm here to tell you today, sis or bro. No, like get that thing cast it out of you and then come on here and tell your testimonies because we should not be struggling with these things and it really grieves me that this isn't preached more um that there's so many youth christians who are upset they're sad they're depressed they have anxiety and it's like you can be set free who is discipling you where are your mentors where are the people who can tell you these vital things for your walk with christ I'm done with my rant. I love you guys. If you have any, you want any information, you need to talk to me about anything, I'm here. Reach out to me. I will talk back to you. Let's get free, y'all. Let's really be free.